was not to perpetuate bureaucracy and not to observe process instead of being effective. This is lives that have been affected and are affected every day. Major roads here has been and another consequence of this is that there's a, because of the change in traffic patterns, the Caesar lane is being used, and there's a left turn there that is far less safe than you know, following the traffic pattern here. Uh, now, the state DOT won't put traffic light in there because, again, process. So, we you know we have uh, the, the the critical federal part is releasing those funds uh, and of course uh, I've worked with our Democratic colleagues in the future of the Hurricane Irene Coalition that's Democrats and Republicans together. From across the areas that were affected by the hurricane by Tropical Storm Lee. And we were very effective at making sure, by working together, by using our voices together to make sure that the funds that uh, were needed to provide relief here from the federal level were appropriate. So we've been doing that, and we've been trying to work with the relevant agencies to make sure that uh, it's an old the process is, is expedited. But you can see what we stand to get. I think a project like this uh, could conceivably take less than a year. There are examples from other parts of the country uh, where using a, an alternative kind of protocol, uh, like a design build instead of design bid build, can result in faster yeah. Yeah. So, why are we doing it? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sure. I wanted to see if I might be able to Yeah, yeah, sure.